For section 5.1.47, the question states the table shows the results of rolling a fair six-sided die, and we're going to complete parts A through D. So the outcome on the die is the first column, which goes from 1 through 6. Here are the 100 trials, 100 trials, and then you have 500 trials. So we're going to use the table, and using the table, we're going to find the empirical probability of rolling a 2 for the first 100 trials. So the event is then rolling a 2 for the first 100 trials. So if you take a look at that column here, we can see that rolling a 2 for the first 100 trials is 14. And so therefore, the frequency represents 14. And we're dividing it by the total number of trials, which is 100. And there, 14 divided by 100 is 0.14. Now again, we're going to use the table we're going to find the empirical probability of rolling a 2 for the second 100 trials. So the second 100 trials is the second column. And if you look here, here's the first 100 trials. This is your second 100 trials. And therefore, rolling a 2 would be 17. So therefore, we're going to take 17 over the total number of those trials, which is 100. And therefore, 17 divided by 100 is 0.17. Now, part C, it says, using the table, find the empirical probability of rolling a 2 for 500 trials. So again, if we're rolling a 2, we're looking at column 2. And for the first 500 trials, well, then that number is represented by 79. So therefore, we're taking 79, but since we're dealing with 500 trials, then we're dividing by 500 trials. So therefore, it's 79 over 500, which gives you 0.16. Now in part D, they want us to compare the empirical probabilities to the probability obtained using the classical method and explain what they show. So the first thing we want to do is that we need to find the classical probability. So in an experiment, if an experiment has n equally likely, out, likely outcomes, and if the number of ways that an event E can occur is m, then the probability of E, meaning the probability of E is calculated using this equation below, which is m over n. Now the classical probability of rolling a 2 with a fair six-sided die rounded to two decimal places is 0.17 and the empirical probabilities approach the classical probability as the sample size increases and this is an outcome expected according to the law of large numbers.